So while we're on the subject of the coronavirus and the Delta variant, um, I, again, I just did a report about my local county commissioner meeting and about how uh, Pasquotank County, North Carolina, is 55% vaccinated. Right? You know, that's an F. If you were to go to school, you would fail. 55% is garbage. But here we are, Pasquotank County has 55% of vaccines. And so... Um, we've got this new poll that came out, Axios Ipsos poll. Most Americans favor mandates for masking in schools. Now, this is adjacent um, because when I went to the county commissioner meeting, I noticed that no one was where I met. Even the, the people from the health department, now Pasquotank County is Republican controlled, uh, the people from the health department went up to the podium talking about how everyone needs to start wearing masks and she had no mask on. What? But this poll came out and I wanted to talk about it a little bit. Percentage of adults supporting mandatory masking in schools. Democrats, 92%. Who are the 8% of Democrats? They're like, free the fate! 67% of independents, 44% of Republicans overall, 69. But and you like... 44% of Republicans. Now, this is interesting because there's like kind of like a half and half split here in the Republican Party, and I could go off on that. But the idea that Republicans are just this, like, they literally are taking every step on a personal and a political level that they can to kill kids. The party of save the babies and think of the children and, you know, like, you know, it's life at inception. That same group, the pro-life group, is literally doing everything they can to murder children. Think about that. So I want to read this. Uh, what they're saying, this is what we're seeing so much conflicts at Cliff Young, president, and blah, blah, blah. The data shows the public policy and public health is continuously challenged by our politics to today. And that at the end of the day, it's all politics is local. Overall, 69% of respondents support their local school districts requiring everyone, including teachers, students, and administrators, to wear masks in schools, but that was true for just 44% of Republicans compared with two-thirds of independents and nine in ten Democrats. 64% of respondents support state and local mandates requiring masks to be worn in all public areas. Just one in three Americans support state laws prohibiting local governments. So 33% of Americans support the, like, bizarre mandate bans. What? But that number makes a big partisan gap. 57% of Republicans support those laws compared to just 16% 6, of Democrats support Greg Abbott and Ron DeSantis' bans on mask made. What? 55% of Americans support companies requiring all employees to be vaccinated to return to the workplace. That's nearly 8 in 10 Democrats. But just 3 in 10 Republicans. Just half of respondents said their employees are requiring masks to be worn. Employers are requiring masks to be worn at work, and 16% said their bosses are requiring all employees to be vaccinated. Um, uh, this is another thing. While most people across party lines knew the facts, Republicans were disproportionately likely to answer incorrectly or to say they didn't know. A jarring half of all respondents either said. There's no evidence that wearing masks in schools give children more protection against COVID-19 or said they don't know. You know it's bad. Let me turn my AC off. Um, you know it's bad when the poll... Like, polls usually try to be neutral. You know it's bad when the poll itself is calling the results jarring. You know it's you know that you are in for a fucking heaping helping of cringe when the supposedly neutral polling place is calling half of the respondents jarring. I Lord have mercy. So this is the world that we're living in, folks. The Repu at least half of the Republican Party wants to literally sacrifice all of our children to the gods of I don't know, whatever the fuck. Lord. Ugh. 